Kingdom Saints, subscribers, viewers, welcome to my channel. I am going to share a poem with you. For all interested, don't click off yet because this poem is very, very deep and it will touch your soul. It will touch your soul. It's called, How Do I? Because are we walking as Christians? And even ones that's not walking as, as a Christian, they want to know, how do I do this? How do I do that? You know, there's really no requirement except faith and perseverity. Being able to withstand the evils of this world. So I wrote a poem about it. How do I? How do I walk with God each and every day? Jesus said, I gave you my son, the lamb, whose precious blood was poured so that the light of the Savior can live inside of you and show you the way. How do I turn from a life of sin and acknowledge God in all ways if I love the life that I live now and I don't know how to pray? I sent my son Jesus to Christ to teach you how to pray, to walk in righteous ways, and to put all of your trust in the Savior each and every day. How do I inherit the grace and eternal life in heaven that is promised to me if all I know is this life that I live so carelessly and the sins of this world seem to cling to me and by Satan I am always deceived? Knock and the door will be opened. Ask and you shall receive. Open your mind and your heart and confess all of your, all of your sins. And in my son Jesus, you must put all your faith in and in him you must believe. How do I inherit the faith that I need to have salvation when the adversary attacks me every day with all his might and I walk in darkness as in without the light and blind as in without spiritual sight? If you believe in me, then you believe in my son, for we are one. Lay your buttons down, take my yoke upon you, and learn from me, for my yoke is easy and my burden is light. How do I begin to know God's word? How do I walk with him each and every day? How do I stay on my knees and say the things I need to say and pray the way the Messiah taught his disciples and all those who have faith in him? Study his words in Matthew 6, verse 10. When you pray, pray to your Father in heaven, and his light will shine in you every day, and he will send a spy into the camps of all your enemies and make the evil darts of the wicked one go away. He will send the Holy Spirit to live within and eradicate all forms of wickedness and sin. He will make you whole and remove all sin and make you new again. How do I begin to know God's word? How do I walk with him each and every day? How do I stay on my knees and say the things I need to say and pray the way <clears throat> the Messiah taught the disciples to pray? How do I build an intimate relationship with God the Father and Jesus his Son so that I can receive the promises of God and live with him eternally? Confess all of your sins to God the Father. Have faith in Jesus, his Son, for they are one. But when you pray, go into your room and pray to your Father who is in the secret place. And your Father who sees in secret will reward you openly. How do I battle the evil and the temptation to commit more sin? How do I live a life filled with the grace of God and the light of his son Jesus shining within? How do I become a new man and the old man is withered away? I want to learn how to worship the Lord and his son Jesus who just for me has made a way. I need to know if I have a guaranteed salvation. 
My friend, Jesus, my Savior, shed his blood not just for me, but also for you. And there is no one on this earth that can go through what the Savior had to go through. No, not me, and no, not you. He died as a ransom for all of our sins so that we can receive God's glorious plan of salvation. He eradicated all of the sins of all of the nations. You must adore and praise him in tribulation, for he saved you and exempted you from the tribulation, gave you a glorious sanctification. Just a mere whisper of his mighty name is an indication to all evil in this nation that they will soon be in dire eradication and cessation, instantly fulfilling the propagation of our Lord and Savior coming down from heaven in fierce jubilation and graceful decoration adorned with the weapons to cleanse the world from the evil one to annihilation, commencing the consummation and the confirmation that we have received our eternal eternal congregation in our fatherly's heavy ha- heavenly habitation my friends do not let the evil one deceive you for this is all that you need to do just believe in Jesus and confess your sins to God the Father let the pl- precious blood of Jesus wipe your slate clean don't hesitate it is on God's word that you should ne- meditate I say to you that it's never too late if God can save a wretched man like me it's even more wonderful what he can do for you I love my Savior oh that name Jesus for it's not for him I know not what I would do or where I would be I love the light of Jesus shining inside of me shining eternally for all to see oh my precious savior oh that name jesus i shall praise his name endlessly you heard let the church say amen